Hey guys and welcome back to this Boom Beach episode. So today we've got some attack replays to show you. So starting off with the first raid of today, this one's called Divide and Conquer. And as you can see the uh, base is sort of split down the middle with uh, the sniper towers on the left and with machine guns and just sniper towers on the right. So I decided to attack on the left purely because it seemed a lot easier. Um, so just coming out here, I'm not going to use one of my flares because we can get some more ammunition from these barrels. And as they, uh, my troops go ahead and take out those two barrels, that's going to give me 11 ammunition to spend on this machine gun up top. So with my troops, um, they seem to be holding in quite well. This is going to be an easy victory. Um, just going to watch Mazookas deal all the damage. So speeding it up, you can see that my troops easily get a victory and those sniper towers were out of range. So the HQ went down there, so that's good for us. And that's going to get us another victory with quite a lot of resources. Um, so let's take a look at the next one. This one's called Triple Whistle. Um, there's three mortars, um, but I don't have strong enough um, missiles or enough ammunition to be able to take one of them out. So now that that one is like pretty much dead, I'm going to deploy my troops and uh, the two heavies and um, my riflemen. I'm not going to single any um, mortar out. I'd rather take both of them out to, um, at the same time. Um, but yeah, so as that one goes down, some of my troops head to the HQ and some of them head for this last mortar. So, um, as we try and take this mortar down, it comes really close, and my um, Zooka's really saved me there. So, we take down the HQ um, after taking out all those mortars, and that's going to get us another victory. So, moving on to the last raid of today, this one's called Unstoppable. Um, there are two cannons at the front, uh, two mortars, and two machine guns. So, there's sort of everything's in pairs. Um, so taking out that cannon there and then I'm going to deploy my rifleman first because that cannon is still there and we want to help protect our heavies for later on. So as my rifleman target that cannon there, the cannon will go down and our heavies should be free to stay alive a little longer. So my zookas wander a little too close to that rifleman there and he begins to just take out both my zookas. Even though I did deploy a healing spell there, um, I didn't manage to save my Zooka in time. So unfortunately we lost three Zookas, which is going to take quite a lot of retraining. Um, but yeah, they go ahead and take out the HQ and that's going to be another victory. So as you see, we got a few resources there. We lost three Zookas and nine Riflemen. So heading back to base for today, guys. Um, we're going to take a look at what we can do in the command center. Um, so taking a look at this, um, we're going to do the shock bomb to level 2. Um, so yeah, that's going to bring us to the end of today's episode guys. Um, if you like the episode, don't forget to hit the like button. Um, don't forget to comment and subscribe. I'll see you next time.